Hey, Caitlin. <laughs> Do you want to eat this? Not particularly. Oh, yay. This is a dragon fruit. <laughs> um, we just went to the market today to pick up some, like, some food for dinner tonight. And we saw this. It looks a little bit bad. Um, this is a dragon fruit and normally like we watched a couple videos and they said this is like a really expensive fruit But like this was a dollar. This was like one dollar. It was in the sale rack. It's on the sale rack Yeah, so maybe they're not always rack. that cheap, but I was like, hey, I don't Think I've ever had one before so I know I haven't I do know that Japanese markets tend to uh, heavily discount things when they start to look like they're going bad, even yeah. if they're not going bad yet. Mm. Except for a lot of bananas, I've noticed. Like, yeah. They're a lot spottier than I'm used to, but uh, but if anything starts to turn brown, the price drops like 85%. Yeah, so like, for example, this was a dollar, and here is like the outside. This looks, this looks like really yen. cool. Yeah. And then this is like the only part that is going bad, like right there, the only part. There were two more, mm -hmm. and the people who looked at the sale rack after we did took both of them yeah. I noticed, as yeah. well as have about half the stuff on the sale rack but. yeah so in the bag this thing smelled like feet and i had it confused with a different asian fruit that was me no no i did too but this smelled you really smelled bad. like feet too no oh, okay. Mark. okay oh it's glooping on me oh. okay this part smells really bad i think it's bad. smell that mm. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna eat it. Okay, let's go eat it. First of all, I just want to talk about like the colors though real quick. Um, the outside is like a really dark like radish red purple and then it fades into like a greenish and then it's it, magenta. Yeah, magenta and then it pops out into like like a yellow color. It looks really neat. Um, is this like from like a cactus thing? Uh, that's what someone said. Somebody said that? Somebody said that. Someone said it. But anyways. Some random guy yelled at us and said Hey, that's from a cactus. <laughs> we're gonna cut this and we're gonna try this now. So let's go to the cutting board. It's our knife. It's a nice knife, but I need to sharpen it or strop it. Okay, so first you are supposed to maybe cut this end off. I would say that was disgusting. Yeah, okay. So we'll cut this end off just. Oh, it's pretty. Wow. Oh, very nice. Maybe that wasn't so bad after all. It looks so pretty. Okay, so then you're supposed to, I guess, cut it in half. Yeah. Wow, look at that. It's so pretty. And then you can cut it again. The skin's kind of hard to cut through when you your knife stole. Let's see. Ooh, the texture kind of feels like kiwi. Hmm. And then I guess you can just peel it. Oh, wow. Wow. It looks like oranges, like, on the inside. Was that easy to do? It was super easy. Cool. You wanna try? Yeah, I kind of do want to try it, but let's, like, cut it up and put it on a plate. the cutting texture like kiwis a little bit yeah it's like kiwis it's not quite as soft i feel like but it's the seeds and the squishiness it's almost like a gel they look like dalmatian <laughs> i hope this doesn't start anything in me <laughs> okay we're back sitting down jamark has cut up the dragon fruit yes and um first off let's like just talk about maybe like texture. Um, it feels like kiwi. There's no smell. A little smell. bit more firm than kiwi, I think. But. No smell. It looks really pretty. There's lots of seeds, like tons, tons of seeds. Yeah. I could just like show up and up should close shot. It kind of looks like, like a white kiwi if you could see through the kiwi a little bit more. Yeah. And it's not slimy or anything. It looks slimy, but it's not. It's a tiny bit. I don't think so. It's like normal fruit. You wanna try it? Kanpai. Kanpai. 
Hmm. Maybe it's not quite. It's not sweet, like at all. Mm. Kind of has more like a vegetable taste. Yeah. Hmm. That one's sweet. I don't know. There's not much taste. Maybe we got like not an okay one. Or maybe just an okay one. Maybe. There's like really <laughs> no taste. ever had dragon fruit before and it is supposed to taste different or if we've hit the nail on the head with just slightly refreshing not really much taste to it taste let maybe us know we have maybe you have colds i don't know but uh let us know because now i'm really curious um overall it's okay but if this is if it's just kind of bland like that Try i don't think i ever have it again tastes a little sweet for 99 cents you can't eat it 97 yen 98 yen I think it's prettier than it tastes. That's my verdict. Do you have a verdict? I think the outside is pretty. Mm. The inside... I don't know. I don't know! It was fun to try, though. Mm -hmm. I'd never tried it before. Hmm. Maybe we'll keep our eyes peeled and try another one sometime. And just see. Compare it. Yeah. Maybe we can find some at one of those fancy, expensive... Itagaki or whatever it's called. Okay, before we end this, the, here in Japan they have like fancy gourmet like fruit and vegetable stores where everything is supposed to like taste better, it like looks better. I don't the know. kind of place where you can buy um, a, what, a watermelon that's been grown into a shape of a cube. Yeah. You know, like that kind of place. Yeah. Or like uh, the other day I saw 7,000 yen so like 65 US dollar grapes, like a bunch of grapes, <laughs> a normal sized bunch of grapes for $65. People are gonna want us to do this now. We'll, <laughs> we'll start a Patreon well, account to yeah, try the fancy need. fruit. <laughs> uh, you would have to. You know. Yeah. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. If you wanna see more like food trial stuff that isn't gonna break our bank, please let us know <laughs> in the comments below. <laughs> Bye, see you.